Welcome back to our Business and Wealth Africa channel. Today, we've got this interesting topic for you, so sit back and enjoy. Our topic for this course is turning wooden ways to charcoal briquettes. Charcoal briquettes is a kind of fuel made from charcoal powder, a block made from charcoal or coal dust and burned as fuel. Compared with traditional fuels, charcoal briquettes can not only generate heat continuously but also produce no smoke and odor during combustion. Therefore, it has been widely used in domestic and industrial applications in recent years and has become the most popular fuel in many countries such as Kenya, the Middle East, Uganda, India and many other countries. With the increase in its economic benefits, the charcoal briquette process has become one of the many hottest processing industries. Let's now take a look at some of the composition of charcoal briquettes. The charcoal briquette is mainly composed of two parts, the charcoal, which is to provide heat and the minor ingredients. Charcoal is the product of incomplete combustion of wood or wood raw materials or pyrolysis under the condition of air insulation. Its main component is carbon, so it can be used as fuel. The minor ingredients include accelerant, white ash and briquetting binder. Let's now discuss further on this component. 1. Charcoal Charcoal amounts for more than 70% of the entire charcoal briquettes. As the combustion material provides heat, the raw materials for charcoal can be various woods such as beech, birch, hard maple, pecans and oak. Charcoal are not only limited to wooden products, we can also get charcoals from coconut, sawdust and some other materials. You can check out our video title, Important Things and Safety Step to Know Before Venturing into Charcoal Briquetting World for more information. The charcoal is mainly processed by the clean. In general, the charcoal produced and extinguished in this clean is called black wood charcoal. It has the advantage of being easy to ignite, but it is also easy to explode during burning with a short burning time and much smoke. Why the white wood charcoal can be oxidized and generates white ash after being carbonized? Our second ingredient is accelerants. The charcoal briquettes cannot get into full contact with oxygen during the combustion process, so the accelerator is needed to accelerate the combustion. The most suitable accelerator is the nitrate, which cannot only provide oxygen to accelerate combustion, but also heat during combustion. However, nitrate is too expensive. An excellent accelerator with lower cost is sawdust. 10 to 20% of sawdust can be added to effectively increase the burning speed. Our third component is white ash. As one of the minor ingredients, white ash accounts for only 2 to 3% of the charcoal briquettes, but it plays a very important role in the burning process of charcoal briquettes. By observing the degree of turning white, we can judge the burning degree of the charcoal briquettes. In addition, because of the white ash is not compostable, it can effectively extend the burning time. Our last component is the briquette binder. Due to the lack of plasticity, the binder needs to be added in the process of charcoal briquetting. The proportion of binder in the charcoal briquette is about 5-7%. to Numerous facts show that starch has the best performance as a binding material. A thick paste is formed from the starch so that the charcoal powder is stuck together to facilitate the later briquettes. Another popular briquette binder is Arabic gum or Acacia gum. You can also decide to use the waste paper plump. With different composition ratio of this component, the final produce will be different. We now take a look at the advantages of charcoal briquettes. 1. High combustion value. That is more than 80% of the biomass. 2. It has longer burning time as well as a more uniformed and stable burning process. 3. It is smokeless and tasteless. 4. It is lighter than the black wood charcoal. 5. It is cheaper 
than plumpy charcoals. And six, it is easy to handle, pack, transport, and use. We will also consider the advantages of charcoal briquettes during production or processing. One, when compared with other fuel, the biggest advantage of charcoal briquettes is that it has no environmental pollution during the whole process. Secondly, there is no waste material. With no chemical added during the entire processing of charcoal briquettes, the required minor ingredients can be replaced with sawdust waste paper plum or many other. Not only is there no waste slag, but some waste can also be recycled and reused to create benefits. 3. No waste liquid. The whole process does not need to add or to drain water or any liquid, so it will cause no pollution to the water sources. 4. No waste gas. The gas generated during the processing of charcoal briquette is only water vapor and some combustible gas which causes no air pollution. It is worth mentioning that this part of combustible gas can be recycled and used as fuel which can reduce the cost at the same time. In conclusion, it is not so difficult to process charcoal briquettes. But we need to pay attention to many details such as component ratio and moisture, all of which will directly affect the final quality. Therefore, you must understand every step and details of charcoal briquetting processing before venturing into this space. Also, choose a reliable supplier for the purchases of your equipment needed in the production such as rock crushers, dryers, briquet machine and many more. I hope you found this video insightful. Do let us know what you learned in the comment section. And also, if you aren't subscribed to our channel, just know you are missing out on all this informative content. Until we meet again next time, don't forget to subscribe to our Business and World Africa channel for more updates.